Today I happen to be at Franklin Park, which is on the east side of Columbus, just off Broad Street. If you haven't been out here, there's plenty to see and do. For example, the lake over my shoulder here, it's absolutely beautiful. There are waterfalls associated with this. So if you haven't been out to this park, there's tons of trails. Come on with me, I'll show you what it's all about. Franklin Park is an exciting place for year-round fun. The 100-acre shared park is a popular destination for community events. The park is also home to the Franklin Park Conservatory. Now in 1852, an 8-acre county fairground, the Franklin County Agricultural Society grounds, opened on what was to become Franklin Park. Fairs were held there for 30 years as the grounds were expanded to 100 acres. Urbanization of surrounding lands forced the county to abandon the land in 1884 and establish new fairgrounds at its current location. Ameriflora, an international horticultural exhibition, was held in the park in 1992 as part of the Columbus Quincentennial. The exhibition cost $95 million to produce and attracted 5.5 million visitors. Some of the features from Ameriflora still remain in the park, including the lake with a fountain and waterfalls, floral gardens, and a sculpture near the conservatory, walkways, and the conservatory expansions. In 2009, a vast community garden area in the southeast corner of the park opened. One of the events that is found here is the Asian Festival, which is usually held around Memorial Day weekend. It typically brings in a hundred thousand visitors. This sculpture in the background represents Christopher Columbus's three ships left over from Ameriflora. Also in 1894, the city of Columbus commissioned a local architect to design a facility to be built in the park similar to the Mammoth Glass Palace featured in the 1883 Columbian Exposition in Chicago. The Chicago Glass Palace was inspired by the London Crystal Palace built in 1850. In 1895, the Franklin Park Conservatory was built. The conservatory housed zoo animals for many years until 1925 when the zoo changed locations. This concludes my video on Franklin Park, which happens to be in Columbus, Ohio. If you haven't checked out some of my other park videos, I have lots on Central Ohio. Make sure you do that. But in the meantime, make sure you subscribe. Thanks and have a great day. Thanks for watching. Now get out and explore.